Defender, Galaga, R-Type, Sinamora, and Ikaroga. If you are a fan of these shoot 'em ups or any other shmup genres, then you most likely recognize these titles. And most likely, you've been playing your favorites or new favorites on the Nintendo Switch. Announced recently during the Gorilla Collective, Com8 Com1 developers and Heads Up Game Publishers released the latest entry in the genre called Rigid Force Redux. Before I go any further, I want to thank Com8 Com1 and Heads Up for this opportunity and honor to check out their work before the announcement. Now let's get back to this game, which Taking what they've learned from Rigid Force Alpha on Steam, Com8 Com1 redeveloped the game to run at 60 frames per second and rebalanced the game's difficulty, as well as improved in overall visuals. And rebalancing the game's difficulty is something I can definitely appreciate. The game even has a playable tutorial to help you get used to the game's mechanics and controls. Once you got everything down, you can jump into the main mission which has some animated cutscenes, learning from your AI shipmate, Sai, or if you prefer, once it is unlocked, you can jump into arcade or boss rush modes, making your way up the leaderboards and defending your spot on the list. For most of my time with the game, I played the main mission on my Nintendo Switch, both in TV mode and in handheld mode. One thing I noticed while playing was the game's achievement system, or trophy system. There are 40 achievements to unlock, which also provide some of the game's artwork that you can preview, download, or you know, send to yourself and download and save to your as wallpaper. Overall, I found this game to be fun, even during some of its punish punishing moments. Warning. I'm looking at you, Armored Mole. Most games in this genre can be punishing throughout, but I found its punishing moments to be an opportunity to learn from my mistakes and to try again. The only complaint I have so far is the credit system. You get three continues to start with. Once spent, you start all over again. And that sucks for me personally. I need more chances and I hope there is a cheat code for more lives. You know, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, BA, select start. I need that. If you are a shmup fan, I believe this is a worthy addition to your collection. I also think this is a great game for noobs like myself to get if interested in the genre and want to learn, which I felt like I did and hope to apply more and more as I play this game. If you're interested, Rigid Force Redux is under 20 in most regions in the Nintendo eShop or Microsoft Store. Thanks for taking the time to watch this review. Until next time, this is Tim signing off. Check you later. No time to lose. That's the spirit.